Honduras has established diplomatic ties with China on Sunday after breaking off relations with Taiwan, which is increasingly isolated and now recognized by only 13 sovereign states. The two countries have welcomed the new development, with Honduras now supporting the One China policy. Here's more details of that in this report. China State Councillor and Foreign Minister Qing Gang and his Honduran counterpart, Eduardo Vina, signed a joint communique in Beijing on Sunday to formally establish diplomatic ties between their two countries. In a statement on Twitter, the Honduran Foreign Ministry said it recognizes the existence of one China in the world, and the government of the People's Republic of China represents China as a whole. The Central American country has also cut diplomatic ties with Taiwan and promised not to conduct further official dealings with the island. China's foreign ministry said in a statement that Beijing appreciates Honduras' attitude. The One China Principle is the general consensus of the international community and the basic norms of international relations recognized by the UN General Assembly Resolution No. 2758 of 1971. Honduras government chose to stand with the other 181 countries in the world to recognize and accept the One China Principle and to establish diplomatic relations with China without any preconditions, which is in the fundamental interest of Honduras and its people. The Foreign Ministry of Honduras says this is a historic moment for the two countries. Honduras is willing to strengthen cooperation with China in areas such as finance, trade, infrastructure, science and technology, culture and tourism, and to closely communicate and coordinate under multilateral frameworks. The two countries say they will appoint ambassadors as soon as possible and all necessary assistance will be provided to establish embassies.